Welcome to Adrian's TV and we are going to check out Survive Squad. Now unfortunately this is not going to be an idle game, you're not going to have idle features, but this is going to be a roguelike game and you're going to be able to equip your main hero, the one that you decide to use obviously, and you're going to be able to level up his items if you're going to have enough gold coins. In order for you to get the gold coins, you're going to need to jump into the game. You're going to be able to get different kind of heroes in your team. That's why the game is called Squad. And you're going to kill these monsters that will appear. And you're going to be able to level up, pick up different kind of skills. Because obviously that's what you do in these roguelike games. And if you're going to be able to get enough power in your team, you're going to be able to go forward and forward in the campaign mode, also in other game modes, in order for you to be able to level up your main main heroes. As further as you go, you're going to unlock new and new heroes with different kind of skills. You're also going to be able to have Zeus from what I've noticed, which is quite, quite nice. You're going to have the possibility, here it is, the Shocker, sorry, not Zeus, but it's the Shocker. Let me select him and he will throw lightnings towards the enemies, which is, hey, let's say a good, good skill because he has a fast attack speed. Now, guys, probably have played similar game. This is a roguelike game, remember, unfortunately, it doesn't have uh, either reward. Every once in a while you're going to be asked if you want to watch an ad in order for you to get extra levels out of that skill. You can watch those, those are really really helpful and that's how you're going to be able to progress faster honestly. Now if you're not going to watch the ads it will take a while, I would suggest to watch every once in a while some ads because they're going to be helpful. Eventually you're going to be able to pick only three more heroes, besides the main one that you have you're going to be able to have in your team four heroes. Okay. So you're going to be able to pick up three more heroes in your team in order for you to be able to pass this specific location. Let's say definitely go for the chest that I have the tongue out because they're going to provide you with a nice nice skill that you definitely need. Okay, watch out what kind of skills are going to collect and so on and so forth. Probably have played similar games. You most likely uh, played a similar idea at least. But if you haven't started this game, let me know in the comments. And also guys, a really important thing for you to know, if you're going to subscribe over here daily, you're going to be able to see every day a new idle game on this channel, which let's hope that eventually you will start playing. I mean a game. Guys, don't forget to subscribe. Okay, let's go back because obviously it's kind of the same idea. Eventually you're going to meet with the same bosses, bigger, bigger bosses, sorry. You're going to have different kind of rewards, a free reward. Well, it's not free because you're going to need to watch some ads a lot of them every 10 ads that you're going to watch they're going to add up and you're going to be able to unlock a mega ad box you have the possibility to spin the lucky uh, wheel over here let's say and you're going to get a different kind of rewards out of this part as well different kind of keys that will unlock different kind of chests over here in the shop and from those you're going to be able to get different kind of items that you need okay let's unlock this one and let's see what i'm going to get okay some hero fragments definitely that i need and some items okay i got zeus if you're going to go over here you're going to hit fuse you're going to be able to get better and better items fuse them again no it doesn't work well hey what do you know okay you can upgrade the captain also that's really really important for you to know and you can see what other types of heroes do you have over here in order for you to be able to place them in your team which is not that hard okay you're going to have the talents where you can consume some gold coins but also the mastery is also over here you can consume some gold coins in order for you to increase different kind of stats that you will use in your game mode which is important you're going to have the quick battle basically some game modes where you're going to be able to consume some tickets that you have and you're just going to need to survive kind of the same idea from the campaign mode uh, but you're going to get other type of resources also you want to farm over here because you're going to need these resources keep that in mind that's why the game is uh, let's say built like this okay now if you have played this one and went further drop a comment let me know obviously you have better roguelike games drop them in the comments i have played some roguelike games and definitely you can check them on the channel now don't forget to subscribe as I mentioned and drop a comment if you know better, better games. These ads will help you every once in a while in order for you to boost your skills, okay? I'm gonna exit over here and don't forget to upgrade your talents and your masteries and don't forget that you need to watch some ads every once in a while. Until next time, take care and be safe. Bye.